It's taking too long. Patience. Patience. I don't see what patience has to do with this. It should have happened by now. Life keeps to its own timetable, not ours. Oh, it doesn't stop us from trying. Good morning! Your ruler has risen! Rejoice! And let bellow the horns of birth! <laughs> Immortal protector of the nation, progeny of the great bloodlines, master of strategies, eternal conductor, and forger of matrimony. We're here to advise you on how to handle ruling and commanding... <laughs> Horns of battle! Fine, we'll have to do this later. The Cadence is attacking. Heroes, jump in! The ruler will be with you shortly! And off they go. We'll explain later. We just need you to take command because our citizens, understandably, find it hard to trust a giant talking chalice. We are not just a giant talking chalice. But the nation will listen to you because you're of their blood. Forge from the bloodlines of the great houses. Oh, and one last thing. Unfortunately, the bloodline ritual that was used to create you also bound you to us. So you can never leave the throne. But do not despair. You can still command your heroes. Look inward, and you will find that your mind can follow them anywhere. You see your heroes yet? Yeah? Great. Now, take command and search the area. Cadence is out there somewhere. First catch of the day. We can't tell you much about the cadence because not much is known. It's old, first sighted centuries ago. It cares only for destroying our nation with its corruption. That's where pawns like you see here come in. Think of them as attack dogs the cadence creates to spread corruption in the world. At least they belong to heroic bloodlines. Oh yes, we forgot to mention. Normal humans cannot survive even a single touch from the kings. But because the bloodlines of your heroes are attuned to us and have our power flowing through them, they have a fighting chance. <laughs> How about that, eh? One down, untold millions to go. Wasn't fun. 
Caden's cowards. They'd rather stay back and snipe at you than fight up close. Be wary. If your heroes are hit, they may forget some of their combat training. The mind is just as vulnerable as the body. Seeds. Arguably the lowliest of pawns are more nuisance than menace. But if you're going to remember one thing, don't let those runts form a posse. Keep them apart. Otherwise it'll be like when caber jacks get together at a tavern. Except not the best night of your life. one of our alchemists. A brilliant mind in a delicate body. Not worth much in a close quarters battle, but they make up for it with their nasty exploding flasks. Just watch out for friendly fire. The explosions are big, so aim well or keep your heroes back. Trust us, you don't want to be on the receiving end of one of their concoctions. Here you have the hunter. Attacking at close range is good, but attacking from afar, where one can think and plan, is better. If you listen closely, you might be able to hear your group leaving you behind as you line up that perfect shot. Actually, the hunter will be in front of the group, stealthily scouting ahead. Is that what they say they're doing? This is a caber jack. They hit things with a caber. Sometimes they hit hard and put things down. Other times they hit not so hard and just knock things out. That's all you're going to say. Simplest way of life there is. Caber jacks. Found purveyors of violence. than I expected. Well done. Well done. I knew you'd have a knack for this. Right. So this is our nation, and as we said, we are not in the best of shape. That muck you see surrounding us is the Cadence. It's what created the pawns, corrupted our lands, and is slowly tightening on us like a noose. But we do have one advantage. 
Thanks to several enchanted materials that make up our body, we've been endowed with certain powers. One of them being a way to cleanse the Cadence from this world. It's really quite a miraculous process, wherein we harness the properties of- The thing is, it takes a long time for us to charge up for this. A long time. All of the heroes you just commanded in battle will be long gone when we're finally ready. With all that time still ahead, we need you to protect us. You will take charge of the nation, command its citizens worthy of becoming heroes, and ensure that the Cadence does not reach the capital. Now let's check out that keep you just saved. The keeps. Bloodline forgers of the nation. The stonemasons did good work here. I'll thank them later. Here you will appoint one hero as a regent, one as a partner. And the more experience they have, the more they'll pass on to their children. That goes for traits and personalities too. Everything's game. And keep in mind, assigning heroes to keeps retires them from combat. You can't have one foot at home and one in the battlefield. 